this video we will be doing a portal presentation before a live shoulder dislocation surgery so in this video we are marking the acromion process the acromioclavicular joint here what we can see is that this marking is the acromioclavicular joint behind that is the acromion the portal we are marking here is the standard posterior portal and then we have an anterior portal and the anterior superior portal which is on the anterior aspect of the shoulder joint besides that we are marking portals with this portal which is called as a port of wilmington and then we can have ports to insert our anchors on the lateral aspect of the acromion and then you can have portals named portals like low posterior lateral portal high posterior middle portal you can have occasionally sub uh, sub acromial portals as well subclavian portals as well and then you can use your nivasier portals etc for your deta uh, detailed examination and detailed execution of the surgery so this is basically a clip from the live surgery that we uh, perform for the training of the orthopedic surgeons so good morning So this is a live webinar uh, which is focused on the training of the new budding arthroscopy surgeons and we would like to make it a very very basic presentation so that everybody must understand how to do a routine shoulder arthroscopy and the surgeries of the instability stuff. The most important thing that you all must know is the surface anatomy. So we will be starting our surface anatomy. So now this is your this is your shoulder we are looking from upside and if you see here this is this is the surface marking this is the posterior lateral edge of the acromion this is the anterior lateral edge of the acromion this is the spine of the scapula this is the acromion process this is the clavicle now we will be starting the demonstration of the portals accordingly now the first portal that we make is the posterior portal that is number one here demonstrated this is the soft spot portal that we make. The second and third portal are the anterior portal and the anterior superior portal that we will make in the sequence. The fourth and fifth portal that we will like to demonstrate is the Niviazir portal and the port of Wilmington which is on the top. We will also like to demonstrate one another portal which is called as a low posterior lateral portal or the posterior inferior portal that is number 6 here and then number 7 is a 5 o'clock portal which we use occasionally to put the inferior most suture anchor. Now I will give you a brief history of this patient, he is a 30 year old gentleman, uh, he has a known history of uh, um, uh, seizures and uh, he dislocated his uh, shoulder while having one of the seizures and uh, had developed a recurrent episodes of instability and dislocation following that. Uh, he presented to me uh, with min multiple opinions and uh, there was a co uh, conflict of opinion between surgeons to either do a arthroscopic bank art with amplisage or to do a letargia procedure. Uh, we did a CT scan for him and the CT scan showed about 15 to 16 percent of the bone loss which is quite consistent of doing an arthroscopic uh, bank art with an amplisage procedure. And now we will just start the procedure. During the procedure I will just uh, uh, I will be giving you hints tips and tricks to make the procedure simpler and uh